video is going to be about how to execute an actual antivirus scan. I'm not going to do the full scan, but I'm going to go through, point certain things out, and then um, show you a demonstrated process. So we're going to go to the Norton 360 icon, or you can go to the system tray and click the icon that says Norton 360. Either way, it will get you to the same place. All right. Oh, cancel this. I accidentally clicked the subscribe now. That's why that window popped up. Anyway, you have this window, and right in the same line with the device security, click on the open button way over here on the right. A new dialog box should open up. Here, you can run a smart. And then we click on the security tab. And when that's done, you click on the scans button. And then you can click on any of these options. In your case, you should be running the full scan. But what I'm going to demonstrate to you is the quick scan because even though it's a different procedure, I'm sorry, a different uh, visual experience, the process is the same. The full scan will check pretty much all of your hard drives and any CD-ROM drive you have connected, which you don't have any in your particular laptop. But I'm going to do a quick scan also because it's quicker. All right. And then you come down here and you click the go button. And you see here, total number of items scanned at the moment. This number should keep ticking up. Kind of a progress bar indicating that something's happening. Look in the upper right corner right here in the blue. You'll see that it's scanning for commonly infected areas and startup files. And then what it's actually checking. And then eventually this part up here where it says scanning commonly infected areas and startup files will probably change to something else. Uh, the total security risk detected, we hope, will always be zero. But more importantly, if this number goes any higher, we will want to see that the total security risk resolved is equal to this number. We found a problem, and then we resolved the problem. Hopefully, this bottom line here, which says total security risk requiring attention, will never be left above zero. Right. So the scan is still running, and I'm going to give this about another minute or so. And um, just want to point some things out. You can see it keeps checking. It's looking for adware, uh, Boolean, and trackware, and virus doctor, and so on. So it's basically looking for all these things that are known problems. And there we go. It finished. So in my case, it scanned 11,844 items. It didn't detect any problems, which is a good thing. More importantly, it didn't have to resolve any problems. And finally, there were no problems left unattended. And there were no threats found. So this green banner is a good thing. So you should have confidence in knowing that you just completed the scan. Again, uh, you click finish here, and then you should be done. Now, I would suggest you click on scans and run the full scan and do that once every three to four days. Okay?